I have to say about this, um, and wearing my old veteran crime reporter hat, I have to say that Conor McGregor is in a very dangerous place right now. Um, you think? He is messing, or he has come into conflict. I wouldn't say messing, but he's come into conflict through probably no fault of his own with a group of very, very dangerous people who are tied up with the Kinnahans. Uh, these people do not care uh, who Conor McGregor is or what he stands for or how powerful he is. They would drag him down into the cesspit. They would, they, I think he, I would say in the next 48 hours, if he's still in the country, and I understand he may have left the country for a few days, uh, if he is not, if he's still in the country, I think and I believe and understand from my sources, the Gardaí would be approaching him to give him, issue him what's called a GIM form, which is a GIM, a Gardaí information message, which is basically to tell him that, that there may be threats to his safety. This, as I said to you yesterday when you were doing this, we were reading those headlines, this is a huge story. And imagine what it would do to our national reputation if this sporting icon was attacked by a bunch of gangsters. Mm. Imagine okay. what it would do. We, it would put us in the same loop as Colombia or any other South American okay. dump. Uh, important to point out, obviously, the, the person, uh, the other person in, involved in this incident is not involved in, in criminality. I didn't say there's other no, people no, outside. Yeah, no, there absolutely. is a person involved in this uh, uh, who is related to people who is heavily involved in criminality. And that's where I just would fear for Conor McGregor's safety. What did Conor do? Did you just get in a brawl in a bar? Is that real? Oh, so... <sighs> You know, in Dana White's scrum, he goes, "Listen, it's a, if it was that big, there'd be more video of it." Dana goes, I, "I, I'm Dana's basically saying I'm skeptical. Hip eyes that happen. People that I know in Dublin and that are blowing me up are saying, dude, it's real. Connor's in a bit of trouble because he has a friend from one area of Ireland that's in this mafia and that got beat up by these guys. Connor finds out the guys who beat up his friend are in this bar, so Connor comes in there and beats the hell out of that guy. Well, that guy's associated with this, you know, pretty intense." Mafia family over there. So now there's a hit out on Connor is what they're saying. What? Yes for 900 grand. What? Mm -hmm. Now how much is that is true? How much of it is speculation? I'm not sure 